neutral side action, and we're just about set to kick off. And now we bring you the coin toss, and it's presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. We're ready to get this one underway as the teams are lined up for the opening kick. Ellison fields it at the 17. He makes it out to maybe the 36-yard line. Well, this offense is going to look to quiet this crowd down. Their big play wide receiver taking the field for the first time. And Freeman's talents are about to be on full display. We've been waiting for this, Kirk. And Brad, as you know, this guy is so talented. He can quiet this crowd all by himself here early on. So I'd expect to see this offense try to look for ways to get him the football and see if he can have some success early to see if he can quiet the crowd by himself. Very solid gain through the air. I'm impressed with the poise of this quarterback and the ability of the receiver to keep his concentration and get his hands on the football. Big opening. Tackle made at the 45. They go with the option and pick up the first down. Yeah, and that was a situation where the quarterback knew he could pick up the first down if he kept it himself. That's a good decision. It's first and 10. Ball on the 45-yard line. at the 34-yard line. Very well-designed play that time to give them a first down. The linemen executed their blocks nicely, and it went for a good game. He's on the run. They'll bring him down right around the 24-yard line. It's second down, and they're about the length of the football from the first down marker. Gets out to about the 21. Felder gets around three on that option keeper. He really did a nice job of anticipating the run and making the play on the ball carrier. Second and six coming up here. Ball on the 18-yard line. Mark four. All right, D, let's go. All right, D. Set. Blue 19. Makes it to the eight. So he keeps it, and he gets a big first down. The quarterback made a very good decision here not to pitch. He saw a break in the defense and just hit it for a big game. And this is the eighth play of the drive. If these defenders continue to exploit the O-line like that, it's going to be a long day for this running back. It's second and goal. Ball on the 10-yard line. And he's tackled at the 8-yard line. This is the 10th play of this drive. Taken down at about the seven yard line. Chavez only gains about a yard with that catch. This isn't much more than an extra point. This to try to put his team up by a field goal. The kick is up and it is good. And you got to think they're pretty happy with holding him to a field goal right there. Looks like they're ready for the kick. He'll take it from the two. Oh, man, did he take a hit. So let's see what the offense can do as they come out onto the field. Here's a running play. He tackles him for a loss.
from their own 29 yard line. It's second down. Stays in bounds and made a nice catch. Nice pickup as they connect on the pass play. Well, they look to be in sync right now. They're both reading the defense properly, and the result is a nice game. He fights forward to about the 43. That's a game of one on the play. That brings up second and nine. It's second and nine. Ball on the 43. Throws it away. Great job by the defense of getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. They'll spread the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five-wide outlook. Throws it in a hurry. He's tackled at about the 47-yard line. Well, we get a new quarterback in there. You have to wonder not only how will he do, but what does this do to the starter's psyche? From the 47-yard line, it's first down. Here's the handoff, and he's taken down for a loss. More plays like this, and the coaching staff is going to need to change up the blocking scheme. You can't allow the defense to play in your backfield. He made a really good move at the line of scrimmage. Sometimes all you need to do is throw off the defender's timing just a little bit at the start of the play. From the 31-yard line, first down. Looking for the corner. He's at the 20. Brought down right around the 16-yard line. He kept it himself and picked up a good-looking first down. Great execution and a good decision there by the quarterback. And this is the ninth play of the current drive. The 10. And he's got the touchdown. Determined running the football. Nobody was going to keep him out of the end zone. And he tacks on the extra point. A nine play, 71 yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well executed touchdown drive. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. Off play action. Now he's on the move. And down he goes at the 34. That brings up second and one. So at the end of one quarter, the Panthers lead 7-3. Set to resume action here in the second quarter, and we've got a tight ball game. Gets to about the 34-yard line. It's third down, and this offense is about three feet away from that first down marker. Brought down in the open 
field. Up of a yard for the tailback. Boy, the senior linebacker's experience really showed on that run. He sniffed it out perfectly and made the tackle. From their own 49 yard line, it's second down. Get to that quickly. And they make the stop, the 39 yard line. Nice throw to hit the out route against man coverage for a first down. McBride comes away with two yards on the carry. From the 37 yard line, second down. Yardage on that run. That's a D4. Third down. Here's the eighth play of the series. And on the throw, he caught it. And he's taken down at about the 25 yard line. That makes it first and 10. From the 25 yard line. First down. He fights forward to about the 23. Here's play number 10 on the drive. Zips it to the back. Tackle made at the 18-yard line. Number 97 and on the tackle at the 18 yard line. Well, they'll line it up again on third down. Two for two so far on this drive. Mike four, Mike four. Oklahoma. Motion. Check, check. Got hit and still completed it. And he's immediately tackled. So the kicking team is on the field. They'll try for three. Kicks away, and it splits the uprights. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. Excellent kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Both offenses have played it pretty close to the best so far in this one. Yeah, because they've been so conservative, it's made it pretty easy for both of these defenses to be pretty dominant. Let's see an offense open it up and take a few chances. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Fires out quickly to the tailback. Tackle around the 40-yard line. First and ten. Ball on the 40-yard line. Gets out to around the 48. Running back picked up about eight on the draw. The Panthers will use their first time out of the half. Bring him down at the 43-yard line. From the 43-yard line, it's first down. He 
He's out of bounds, right around the 40. And he throws it away. Third down now, and they need to get it down to the 33. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. And he tackles them hard at the 34-yard line. Pitch play here. They don't get it. So they turn it over on downs, and that's a big boost for this defense. In a close game like this one, it's big plays like this that can be the deciding factor. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Throws incomplete. From their own 33-yard line. Second down. He scrambled. He's wrapped up for the sack. Sometimes it's just a relentless pass rush that results in a sack. That's what happened there. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Fires quick out to the receiver and he can't make the grab. Now it's going to be fourth down. Nice defense. That was picture perfect three and out. Good series for these guys. He really got a hold of that one. Not a great return there. Boy, he got a hold of that ball. This punter has a big time leg, and you can see that when he gets a hold of a ball like that. It really goes. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. And he's tackled after positive yardage. A great first half comes to a close. 7-6, Panther. we played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. Defense has been dominant in this game. Yards very hard to come by. But they get deeper and deeper into this game. The natural assumption is that the pressure goes to the offense to do something. How much pressure is on the defense not to make that catastrophic mistake? So that's the conundrum you get it. I mean, it makes it exceptionally tough because you want to play perfect and you want to get them to punt every single time, but it's not the way it works. And it's those big plays that you usually see that kill the defenses and break their backs. And you can hold them great, Reese, on first down, second down, it's third and long. You're in a perfect situation. You give up that one play for 80, and it changes the whole complexion of the game. So. I think you got to have a little bit of both. It can't just be great defense the whole time. Usually the teams that play great defense can keep you in it, but only for so long. At some point, that offense has to get something going. Just about set second half. What are you looking for? I'm looking to see which team has that decided schematical advantage. And if they can find it, they'll blow holes three or four axe handles wide. Brad and Kirk will be there to call the second half. And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set for the second half. He sends this one deep. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Both squads are digging in now. Let's see what happens on the drive. They go to the left for a nice game. 
From their own 29-yard line, second down. around the 34-yard line. taken down. Maybe a yard on the run by the tailback. Makes a catch and he's got nowhere to go. down now they need to get it out to midfield they come out in a five wide set fires quickly and he's got his man and he's tackled at the 40 defense coming up with the fumble and the booth is going to take a few looks at this to see whether or not the ball came out before he was down so the question here is whether or not his knee hit the ground before the ball came out after review play the ruling on the field is reversed so after some discussion, the call on the field is reversed from the 37-yard line. It's second down. And he carries the ball for a nice game. Ten yards to go. Ball in the 29. He's taken down around the 17-yard line. Run. 
It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. The short yardage defense here. And a nice move to finish it off. Touchdown. Man, the big fella's a battering ram, isn't he? He's almost impossible to slow down in short yardage situations. He splits the uprights with the extra point. So a 13-play, 71-yard drive, and the result, seven points. And Brad, right now, the offensive line just winning the battle in the trenches, opening up some big running lanes. So the score now, 14-6. They line up to kick this one away. Ellison fields it up at 11. He gets out to about the 25-yard line. Everywhere we go in college football, everybody's got a T-shirt that says, finish, finish. Whether that means finish the game or finish the drive. Right now, this offense is moving the ball, but they're not finishing the drive. They've got to execute better down closer to their opponent's territory. He's tackled around the 24 yard line. It's second down and 11 to go. Ball on their own 24. Decent pickup. Call it a gain of four yards. That makes it third and seven. Right, 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 right. Four down, four down. Mike four, Mike four. There's a strike complete. Brought down at the 47 yard line. From the 47-yard line, first down. He's gobbled up in the backfield. and run up the gut. That's good for yards. The fourth quarter is going to decide who wins this low-scoring affair. 14-6, Panther. Into the fourth quarter now, and we're back to the action. We're still early in the fourth quarter, but that was a huge stop. And now with the lead, they're going to get the football back and an opportunity to stretch the lead. Fourth down, and the offense is still on the field. He gets to about the 27-yard line. And this play is number eight on the drive. hit immediately. That brings us second and nine. From the 25-yard line, it's second down. Nice run, and he's brought down. And this is the 10th play of the drive. First and 10, ball on the 16-yard line. And they 
get nice yardage on that run. We're at the 12th play of the drive. Strike and it's caught for the touchdown. Very important play coming up, and if they can get these two yards, we'll have a tie ball game. He's going to try and scramble, and they won't get the two. It was a 12-play, 74-yard drive, but they just get six points after failing to convert for two. So our score, 14 to 12. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He'll return it from the three. Tackle at the 31. Well, I'm sure the return man would have loved to go for six that time. Brad, with this offense having the lead, you know they're going to work some clock. You know they're probably going to be conservative. This is a good opportunity for this defense to take some chances in their ears back, try to get aggressive and try to get the football back. Finds his man, first down. And he's taken down at the 27-yard line. And a big pickup through the air has made it first and ten. Just under three to go in regulation. It's incomplete. Brad, he drops the ball here. I don't know if he's starting to peek downfield and think about the return or what, but that ball's right in his hands. He just dropped it. Quarterback all by himself in the backfield with five wideouts. And he hits him hard at the 35. Wow, that is a big hit on the quarterback. That's one of those as an offensive lineman. When the film study starts to come around, you're going to kind of sink in your chair and just hope they don't call you out because you're going to get embarrassed on Monday. Now. He might not be able to get the pass off. And down he goes at the 16-yard line. This is a quarterback who trusts his receivers, and he knows they can make plays. It's like those two were playing catch out there. And now he pitches it. Room around the corner. He gets hit out of bounds right around the 12-yard line. It's second and seven. Ball on the 12-yard line. More plays like this, and the coaching staff is going to need to change up the blocking scheme. You can't allow the defense to play in your backfield. Five wide.
big extra point here. It'll put them up by two scores. They just didn't get the snap off in time. Here's the call. Just over a minute left. And he converts the point. like they're ready for the kickoff. And he's tackled at the 31-yard line. Boy, the two offensive coordinators have to be loving this. In fact,